Hi, my name is Angelica Garcia. I am originally from Southern California and I am a first generation college student. To me, being a first generation student means that I get to create my own path, even though I'm put or we are put to the unknown. It is definitely a rewarding process to create my support system and figure out what I want to do with my future. I think that was one of the most um, rewarding parts during my undergrad and graduate career. I think my biggest challenges is um, communication with my family. It was often maybe not fully understood how much I needed to put into school. I have a very supportive family, luckily, but I do have other first gen friends who do not. And I know that's something they struggled with and I can relate to that. They might not understand how stressful certain times of the semester are, or quarter, wherever they are. And having just that connection. But like I said, that doesn't mean they don't know, they aren't supportive. It's just finding that different support system and an advisor or a career coach at the university. I think higher institutions greatly benefit from first-generation students because they bring a new perspective, honestly. Like, I have met so many creative and empathetic individuals who are first-gen, and we are very resilient, and we bring a lot to the table. Everyone has their own experiences that are unique, but being first-gen means we are creating our own path and by being in higher institutions we're not going to see those barriers if we're supported we are breaking down those barriers we are creating new programs new technology all of that like it's a domino effect in my opinion personally i love working as in a type of mentorship position especially now working with first gen students there's so much we could relate to in respects of how we feel academically if we feel like we can't do it you know the whole imposter syndrome comes often into our conversations but it's just building that connection and letting them know like hey i did it they did it your mentor did it all these other people did it you can do it too and no one does it alone i think that's something that i would like to break down as a stigma that you just have to work hard and do this. You've got this. I guess this is your degree, but there's so many people here that are willing to support you and help you get there. And I think that's really important to remember. So all the feelings I had during my undergrad of feeling unprepared, inadequate, like multiplied. And it was really stressful, but I knew I wanted to be there. I was very passionate about my program. So I just, you know, kind of kind of like freshman year, had to rebuild my support system because I was in a different program, a different school. So I needed to figure out what was going to work for me, how to get the help that I needed, especially in points that I knew I needed more assistance with, for example, writing. Um, I definitely take more time for writing and I've never let that hold me back though. And I did it, I mean, there was a lot of stressful nights for sure, but I don't know how I would have, would have done it without my family support, my academic support, and my friends support, because they are really part of my backbone in the process, even though my family won't completely understand exactly what I went through. Their words of encouragement and support, whether it was giving me more time, of quiet time at the house or giving me food when I couldn't go get food. Little things like that really helped me move forward and made me realize, yeah, they don't understand what higher education is or exactly what my graduate program is, but they're there for me regardless. Overall, people should look out for first generation students because we're unstoppable and we're going to 
build a bigger and better future for our generations. And I think that's just the amazing process. Sometimes I think about it, I'm like, wow, like, I can't believe I did my undergrad and then my graduate back to back. And it's just amazing. I think education in general is something we should all keep in our lives and know that we will never stop growing. And I think that's pretty fun.